Grab some glass bottles and come make an upcycled sea glass craft with me. So I just started by removing the labels and cleaning my glass bottles really well. Then I went outside and spray painted the bottles with this sea glass spray paint. And just a note about this spray paint, most spray paint is opaque, so you won't really notice if there's uneven coverage. However, this spray paint is more translucent, and that means you need to be extra careful to get even coverage and avoid any sort of pooling. The best way to accomplish this is by applying very light coats, and I mean very light. For these bottles, I probably applied eight coats, letting them dry 10 to 15 minutes between each coat. Once everything had dried, I brought my bottles inside and grabbed some paint stir sticks and my miter shears. So I just cut paint sticks in half, but what I did is I cut the handle off first, and then I cut them in half, but like staggered. So like, I think if I was dealing with like the full nine inches, it would be like four inches and five inches, right? But cut enough to go all the way around each jar. So what I did is I hot glued the little paint sticks in place. And yes, I know hot glue on glass, like this isn't gonna be permanent hold, that was not the point. It was just to like hold these in place long enough that I could then wrap them with ribbon and twine to hold them in place long-term. Um, so I just put all those little cut paint sticks around the jar. And then I found this really cool ribbon at Dollar Tree, this is just like a white webbed ribbon. So not quite a lace, just something a little bit more modern. And then I just wrapped that around the paint sticks, followed by some dollar store twine, wrapped it around a few times, tied a bow, and then finished the look with these little cardboard decal things from Dollar Tree. I just took one that was like a seashell, paint painted it white, super simple, and hot glued that right in place. And here's my finished project, two nautical sea glass bottles. I can never resist upcycling when I find unique glass bottles, and I love the way this one turned out. I do hope you enjoyed watching this craft come together. Until next time, happy making.